Hello, and today our camera guy, thanks Ben, has asked us to do a sort of worktop review, kind of what cool stuff we have all over our desk during our everyday work. So I've grabbed a couple of bits, I'm just going to talk through them really quickly. So hopefully this is interesting to you, and if you want to show us your desktop as an electronics engineer, a development engineer, feel free to post it and then tag us. So, object number one, of course, we'll start with the Pegascope. You've always got to have one of these. BNC cables, super useful, probes, and USB cables, especially for USB oscilloscopes. You've got to have loads. If you don't have enough, get some more. Also, we need a power supply. So a lot of things need the power. Power supply supplies the power. Boom. TCO8 is great to have like anytime. Anytime you need temperature measurements, grab a TCO8, whack it onto your PC. Boom, you're measuring temperature. Too cold in this room? Get the TCO8 out. What else have we got here? So we have our probe positioning system. You can stick PCBs on here, have them nicely dangling like that, put some probes in using the rest of the system, sorted. That's amazing. Next, Raspberry Pi. You cannot have enough Raspberry Pis in your life. They'll provide beautiful decoding things that you can decode with your Pegascope. You can run TCO8 software on them. Amazing, get some of those. What else do we have? MSO leads. These are great. Uh, enough said. <laughs> These boxes are awesome. These are project boxes filled with all sorts of bits and bobs. So we have stepper motors, we have joysticks, controllers, uh, RFID systems, and you can just start decoding. You can make your own prototype board. Really good for demonstrations and really good for learning electronics as well. Boom, next, notepads. This is a Pegascope one. You can have any kind of notepad, but you want to write stuff down because otherwise you forget it. And it's great to just do quick maths. Next, breadboards. You have Raspberry Pis, can't get enough of them, get breadboards. You need loads of these. So these are just lying around. I find them in weird places. Please help me. Um, probes, I've already said about probes, but this is a high voltage probe, a differential probe, which is great to have. It might be a bit expensive if you're a hobbyist, but if you work in a lab, grab one of these. Next, SMA spanner. Um, spannering SMAs and uh, other RF equipment. It's good to have, you can get ones which click uh, when it's at the right torque. This is just a little cheap one that we provide. And then Pegascope 2000 series. These can fit anywhere, you can put them in your back pocket. So make sure you always have one of these at hand. Even if you've got another one of these, just, just grab an extra 2000 series. Laptop, you're using a USB oscilloscopes, you need a USB PC to talk to them with, so have a laptop. So that's mostly what's on my desk. Um, there's a lot more stuff, a lot of rubbish, a lot of half-finished projects, and a lot of things I want to fix, um, so I need to get around to that. But yeah, show us your desk, and we'd love to see it, and see where you integrate your Pegascope at work or at home. Thanks.